Okay, so we're going to go ahead and uh, get started with the, the webinar today. First off, I'd like to uh, thank everybody for attending our webinar on Oracle BI Publisher Interactive Standalone and OneView Reporting for J.D. Edwards. So we'll go ahead and uh, get started. We've got a lot to cover in a fairly short period of time. So um, like I said, we look forward to, uh, to sharing this webinar with you and, uh, and addressing any questions you may have. Uh, my name is Adam Krieger. I'm the President and Founder of Preferred Strategies, and I'll be walking through today's webinar. The agenda, I'll real briefly get into my personal background and experience, uh, go over briefly the J.D. Edwards data model complexities, overview of preferred strategies, be a publisher, get right into the live demonstration. Then we'll kind of come back to a few PowerPoint slides, uh, kind of go over the strengths and challenges of BI Publisher, and then talk briefly about uh, BI Quick Launch, which is our jumpstart package for BI Publisher for JD Edwards customers, and then we'll address the questions at the end. So what are some of the, the JD Edwards data model complexities? So there's, there's a lot. This is actually just touching the surface, but uh, there's thousands of J.D. Edwards tables within the uh, the data model. They've got cryptic names like F0006 and GMOBJ for the fields. The dates are stored in a Julian format. Amounts and units are, are stored without decimal places. Just pulling different user-defined code descriptions in the system can be difficult. Uh, Subledgers, even some of the data across modules. Uh, equipment number on the GL might be a 25-character alpha field might be a numeric field in fixed assets or enterprise asset management and a nine character alpha field with you know non-leading zeros or leading zeros potentially in, in uh, HR payroll so so just all the complexities uh, and then for reporting sake a lot of times you want to report things like month to date amounts quarter date year to date actuals and budgets and and so all of this uh, figuring out where does the data reside in the data model and how to relate the data uh, to get reports out in the hands of users is something that's not always a, a simple task. So these are just kind of, again, some of the data model complexities. Uh, so that's kind of probably why you're here is trying to figure out, one, what does the BI publisher deliver from Oracle, and, and two, you know, how do you simplify a, an implementation of that? So we're going to kind of cover that today. High-level preferred strategies, uh, we focus primarily around business intelligence and reporting technologies for J.D. Edwards specifically. We haven't built our own technology. We've just built content for J.D. Edwards using the market-leading technologies of business objects, Crystal Reports, BI Publisher, which we're going to show you today, things like Microsoft Power Pivot. Um, so we've, uh, rather than kind of build a BI and reporting technology, we've just enhanced uh, the, the market leaders out there um, with accelerators as well as some tailored training that we do. We support direct connect transactional reporting solutions as well as data warehousing solutions and kind of the data replication solutions. So we're not focusing at all today's demo about data warehousing. If that's a, a topic of interest, just reach out. Um, we also, again, provide training, and our training is done on your site using your JD Edwards data. Um, we like to kind of take more of a... Uh, a knowledge transfer role where we show you, we implement our, our pre-built content for JD Edwards to get you jump started. Then we train you on how to become self-sufficient and build out the, the types of reports and, and BI elements that you need. And then we kind of become more of a, a support role. However, if you're in the middle of a lot of projects and need help either building out content yourself, um, we also do custom report design and other types of, of BI related and reporting uh, consulting.